Hey everybody, it's Peter with Lockbox, where we teach you lessons in leads, listings, and leadership. And today we're gonna to be talking about how to win the morning. You know, in our industry, we can have the best of intentions for how we're gonna spend the day, but it's been my experience in most days, more days than not, our day is kind of hijacked by noon, right? Things happen in the industry. We get phone calls, there's title company issues, there's appraisal issues, inspection negotiations, whatever you thought you were gonna do in the afternoon, it gets hijacked either by business or by personal life. And so our ability to uh, level up our production and ultimately our income, we kind of need to contain that to the efforts that we can control during the beginning of the day, during the morning. So winning the morning is critical to winning the business. So I wanna share with you what I've come to experience as the three ways that you can win the morning. And it's all about fueling yourself, right? The first one I wanna to talk to you about is fueling your mind. When you get up in the morning, the first thing most people do is reach for their cell phone. And I know that garbage in means garbage out. So the greatest, one of the best habits I ever got into was instead of reaching for my phone first thing in the morning, I instead sat down and did 20 minutes of meditation. Now, is meditation right for you? It may be, it may not be. But what matters though is I was fueling my mind first with the right energy and thoughts before I let anything else attack my mindset. So it could be prayer, it could be meditation, it could be reading, it could be a writing exercise. Whatever you can do while your brain is silent to get it locked and loaded on the goals that are important for you for the day. After you've fueled your mind, the next exercise is to fuel your body. We are physical entities and we may have the greatest mindset, but if we don't have the right fuel fueling this machine that my mindset executes with, we're never gonna have the best results. And so that means putting in quality calories, right? Good fuel that's not going to surge and then crash, not a lot of sugar, but quality fuel so that your body has good, sustainable, healthy energy. For a lot of people, this also includes some kind of exercise to get your heart up, circle your blood around, get some oxygen in there. There are all these chemical processes that happen in your body to reward physical activity that actually sharpens the acuity of your mind and the energy level that you bring with the day. Once you've fueled your mind and your body, the next thing to do is fuel your business. We are in a sales business. Sales businesses without leads are not businesses, they are failures. And so one of the things that we have to do while our mindset is strong, while our energy is high, before anyone else has hijacked our day, is fuel our business by generating new leads. And that can be however you go about generating business. It could be doing breakfast with um, affiliated vendors. It could be getting on the phone and calling for sale by owners. It could be working your sphere of influence. It could be whatever your social media strategy is. Whatever it is, do that lead generation piece first before anyone else goes after your day and hijacks your energy and your attention in the afternoon. So uh, when I started, there's a million books out there, by the way, if you're interested in winning the day or winning the morning, there's a lot of them out there. Distilled as simply as possible, I think these are the three ways that you go about winning your morning and by extension the day and by extension the business and by extension your finances. Hope this helps, I'll see you in a week. Thanks guys.